open the image that you wish to fade and then go to the left hand side on all of the tools and choose the lipstick icon, the touch up and you can scroll down now until you find the blush boost option and once you've opened that one up just there you'll see there's a few options so this is all about skin tone and you can choose the lightest possible you can maybe go for a bit darker play around with the brush size and the fade percentage just to get the results that you're looking to achieve. The brush size will obviously either do a larger area or a smaller area and the fade again depending on the percentage that you choose. So as you can see here the lightest options within the blush boost is fading my image down quite nicely there. If you're happy with that then you can apply and save your image. However if that's not quite light enough for you you can go back in and choose the colour palette option. You could choose any old colour really that you wanted here but if you choose a white increase the brush size again and take the fade down to 0% this will lighten up your image even more. See how that's going. This is great for if you want to add text over an image but still have that image in the background. So once you're happy with your results press apply and then save your image just at the top there.